Gardner's world favorite Adam Frost revealed that his youngest daughter Amber Lily had become unwell at just 15 and battled an eating disorder. Within months of her health crisis, Adam went through a mental health battle of his own and told his psychiatrist and doctor that he had burnout and depression. Adam revealed that the ordeal took its toll on their family, especially with the added stress of his wife, Amber Lily's mum Selena, being rushed to hospital after an attack of sepsis. Adam says she was hospitalized for three months. Talking of his youngest child's difficulties, he told the Sunday Times, Amber Lily ended up with an eating disorder, like a lot of 15-year-olds, she had friends going through it at school. To top it all off, months later, a COVID diagnosis threw up another issue that Adam hadn't even been aware he was suffering with. I got COVID and was locked in a room. Then 10 days later I was sat in front of a psychiatrist and a doctor and said, you know, I've got burnout and depression, he confessed candidly to the aforementioned publication. It was a surprise as I only went into the room with COVID. The wheels came off a little bit. The TV host found that even his vast garden could no longer comfort him despite finding it a source of solace before. The garden we were in felt quite overwhelming and I was losing my contact with it. He told Round and About magazine. Don't miss! Philip Schofield seen for first time since brother's trial began, update, Paul O'Grady's tearful words prior to his death amid health struggles, obituary. Paul O'Grady's pal saw him full of life at home just before death, latest, the horticulture enthusiast added that when he was poorly, he couldn't summon up any interest in spending time there. Then we simplified life and moved and it was like that connection was reborn, he explained. He and his family said goodbye to an impressive three acres of land, and now live in a much more modest abode, two stoneworkers' cottages knocked together, with less rural splendor around it. However, Adam isn't deterred by the comparative shortage of space, as he grows spinach and potatoes in his new garden. He continues to have a keen interest in the therapeutic effect of gardening and has contributed to a podcast on the subject for Gardener's World, alongside a psychologist. If you're worried about your health or the health of somebody else, you can contact Seed Eating Disorder Support Service on 01482-718130 or on their website https colon slash slash seed eating disorders or dot uk